So first of all, I'm really pleased to be here at Norway House. I feel that the Norwegians have always showed us the way forward, both in terms of environmental activism. Now, clearly, Norway has some incredible resources that the rest of Europe doesn't have. But I think what's really important is that I was with the Prime Minister last week, and there's a real sense of Norway wanting to show leadership and working with Europe in that sense of leadership. And why is that important? Because right now, in my function as the President of the Club of Rome, we have launched our climate emergency plan. And our climate emergency plan basically responds to the IPCC report and says, come on guys, in the next two years we have to put in place the foundations to get us to 2050 net zero scenarios. Statcraft obviously fits into that because what we're calling for in one of our primary actions is to ensure that we triple investments in renewable energy every year until 2030, 2040, 2050 to ensure that we actually make those net zero scenarios. And that will mean that we will need to put in place the right market mechanisms, that we will need to start to also pull out of our high fossil energy investments, our stranded assets from an infrastructure perspective and also from a use perspective. We also talk, however, about the human dimension. And I think the human dimension is really fundamental when you look at what's happening here in France. France now is starting to rebel because of the cost of fuel. What they don't understand in many cases is actually that fuel cost has been the lowest that it's ever been in the last 10 years. What we need to do is explain to the French, to explain to Europeans, that actually the cost for them should not go up as we move towards a decarbonization scenario. We need to put in place just transition funds. We need to work with the people to bring them on the journey so that they actually see that there's a positive vision for Europe if we actually put in place an emergency plan. So we say in our emergency plan, there is an emergence from emergency. There is a potential societal renaissance and opportunity from moving towards decarbonization. And we need to seize those opportunities. And I see Statcraft and the renewables industry as a fundamental part of that journey and working with us in order to make that happen.